I'd like to invite up to the podium now Mr. Todd Holman. He is with the Nature Conservancy. Can you sit for a minute? Todd, can you please come up, please? All right, I'm ready. He's ready. Sorry, Dean. Here's Todd with the Nature Conservancy. Thank you. Thank you, Doug. Um, always a mistake in the identity. Um, uh, some of the, the rest of my introduction includes being uh, elected to the Baxter City Council. And so many of you can see, have seen me in different contexts, different hats. Uh, tonight, very, very proud to represent the Nature Conservancy and, and so, so thrilled to see all of you here tonight to hear and uh, appreciate the folks that have uh, gone before, spoken before unbelievable and fantastic words. Um, by means of introduction, I came to this community in 1996. The Crow Wing County Board saw fit to hire me as the, the planning and zoning administrator. That was at the time, in 1996, that was a hopping office, it still is. Lots of growth and development, many of you have lived and seen that. And to recover from the stress to Adam's point in his message, I would walk down out of the courthouse, down the street to the Laurel Bridge, crawl underneath it on the rocks, and I would watch the river take me away. It was an amazing piece of therapy in a very busy and hectic time, professionally, mentally, and all of the above. So the river, the river really has been a part of my life in all aspects, certainly since I've been here. Um, tonight, can you put that? Oh, there it is. Um, <laughs> My task is to talk a little bit about some of the challenges that the Nature Conservancy as a nonprofit conservation organization um, is choosing to focus, some of the methodology, some of the things we've identified to focus, and then how, how is it that we try to nudge uh, the condition of the Mississippi River and water